You want to talk? Come on, man. The world's best club fitter in Lee. And now I just, I'll just get in behind the camera. <laughs> The Lee and Jim show strikes yeah, again three years after the return. It is, from the return back. <laughs> Seems such a long time. Oh, that's a, I, we missed, man. That's pretty good. Mm. All righty. So here we are at Orange County Golf Club in Orlando for the beginning of the PGA show. And it wouldn't be a PGA show without the Lee and Jim show <laughs> itself. And that what we do is we are here at the Acra Demo Day. And these guys are kind enough to hold this event for us and and we get to see the new product from Acker which is a company that is just devoted to the custom club fitter club maker in order so that you get your best golf and that's what we want right that's where it's we want day. that's right it's all about. so again uh, just so you know we're gonna be doing live streams through the week uh, on the things that we see throughout the day uh, but if not we have it every Monday at 530 p.m. or 1730 Eastern time and we talk about this same stuff. So join us then, like and subscribe, and that way you get more of the videos when they drop. Now that we've covered all that, Lee is gonna present some of the, the new product. And the, I asked him to present these two because of all the ones that we've seen, I think these for our shop are probably going to be probably some of the sweetest ones that we've seen in quite some time. Yeah. Nice. So what do we got? So first of all, Nice to see you. Yeah, it's been, a, it's it's been, been ages, so that's been, good. Three years. Three it's years has been. It's just incredible. But it's, we're back. That's the main that's thing. That's right. Back. That's right. Um, okay, so to run you through a little bit about product. Um, graphite iron shafts. Yeah. Um, some guys, you know, over the years, graphite iron shafts been seen very much as a, a game improvement shaft in some respects. Uh, it's, it's very sort of uh, stiffer in the butt section a little bit st uh, softer in the tip. So what that's doing is promoting a higher launch to help that person to you know, get a little bit more flight on the golf ball. Um, what we wanted to do is bring out a player's graphite shaft. That was the idea of it. Yeah? So somebody who maybe has been uh, through the ranks of a, pro pro a product like uh, Dynamic Gold, something like that, so with a softer butt section and a firmer tip section, and that's exactly what we've done with our TZI iron shaft. Yeah? So we've completely flipped the profile around looking for something for that player that doesn't necessarily want to get the higher ball flight it's going to bring the ball flight down give them that stronger more penetrating flight so the guy that wants to control a shot a little bit more definitely definitely yeah. and it, it's a good range you know it's a good place for us to go i mean our i-series product is all about launch yeah and helping people get some flight on the ball we also have our constant weight product as well um and this was a nice introduction to really if you like complete the lineup of iron shafts that we offer, like, like Jim said at end. the beginning, um, to ultimately cater for any golfer that's gonna walk in your store. Right, so they we're talking about I-Series. It's the stuff when you see when we do the videos, I've got two of everything in their entire lineup, and they go from 40, and now it's gonna go to 80, where the IWC, or IW, ICWT, is gonna go from that, carry from there up into the 115s. Yeah. And that's all about being a friendly golf club, depending on your, you know, how you like your weight and your transitions, the type of golfer you are. And now what they're talking about is, okay, you like the kind of weight, but maybe you're not swinging as hard as you once were, or maybe you are for that matter. And you want, but you want something that's shock absorbing. Yeah. You want something that's going to help with that pain in the joint yeah. that you're going to be there. And you still, you're still that golfer that still wants to control it. And you got the, you know, skill sets. Yeah. This is that shaft. This is the baby. So it starts at 75 grams, goes right the way up through into the heavier weights as well. So it will be a great complement to what we already have. Yeah, and if you like a different player market as well. So we said 75? 85, 95, 105, 150. So you got, all, you got it all covered, right? Every bit of this is covered with a controlled flight. It's going to be shock absorbing. It's got the cool, almost chrome, they call it PVD finish, I yeah. believe. The chrome finish, just like the TZs have got. It's going to be, you know, for those guys, oh, I can't have a graphite shaft, and they see that color. Yeah. And now you see this, it's going to look like a regular, yeah. like a regular shaft That's with a really idea. cool band on it. So, you know, this uh, this is a win-win-win right here. Yeah. No, it's a 360 band as well. 
Um, so the idea being you can orientate the shaft in however you want to, whether a guy's spine or whatever, right. that's, that's personal preference. But yeah, it's designed to look like a steel shaft um, for the guys that have just been used to it their whole playing career. There you go. All right, now into the driver, something new. Something new. So, I mean, ultimately Acra has one of our best selling shafts and best performing shafts on tour has always been our Tour Z line of shafts. Yeah, it's always been great. And if you like, the latest generation of that is going to be our TZ5 and our TZ6 product. So our TZ5 product is ultimately a low launch, low spin product. Um, not necessary for guys just with higher club head speeds. We do do it in weights and flexes for those that, you know, maybe don't swing out their boots, as it were, as mm -hmm. some of the guys do now. Um, but ultimately, it's always going to be that kind of shot, looking that goal for looking to bring their ball flight down. The TZ6, however, was kind of like the opposite. The profile swapped. So we went softer in the tip section, designed to get the golf ball up in the air and to give that higher flight. However, sometimes when you give that type of profile to a tour player, to a very, very accomplished golfer, the softer tip profile worries them. Yeah, they're terrified of hitting the ball left, losing a little bit of control. So the softer tip section kind of doesn't always play in. But what we done with the original Tour, uh, Tour Z, the six, was we lowered the torque. So we, had, we lowered the amount of twisting, if you like, in the tip of the golf shot. And what that done was although that it was soft, yeah, it actually made the shaft incredibly stable. So we had so many tour guys playing a shaft yeah, that ultimately it was a really, really soft tip, but they loved it. It was mm -hmm. great. It helped them get it up in the air, helped them flight it, done everything that they wanted to do. But on from that, what we found was we kind of had two, we kind of had two flights. So you have your TZ5 that's about this high, and then your TZ6 was up here. We needed something in the middle to bridge that gap. And what we didn't want to do was get into a stage where guys were cutting off tip sections of the TZ6, because if you like, that's the money part of the shaft right in the tip section. We don't want to leave that in the bin. So we came up with a way, and we've called it the TZ6ST. Now, the ST stands for stable tip. Okay? Um, so what you're going to see compared to the TZ6 as we have it now, it's going to be a stiffer profile in the tip section, but it's still going to have the firmer butt section. So if you like, what we've done is we've kept the DNA of the TZ6, but just beefed up the tip, uh, the tip section again to give us kind of like that medium ball flight. Lower, lower it down. Yeah, just lower it down a bit, but not as low as the TZ5. However, we've still got very low torque. So although the tip has still gone stiffer, yeah, it's not a, it hasn't, the torque hasn't gone up. So even with it kind of still being um, a reasonably flexible tip, it's still going to be very stable and it's still going to do what you need it to do. Now, and this one will come in 65, 75? 65, 75, M4, M5. And for those of you not in the know, M4, M5, that's basically stiff and extra stiff. And then with some, you can do, obviously you can do some of that moving around, but mm -hmm. that's not necessarily the intention of the shaft. Yeah. And again, it, in the TZ uh, family, it still has the uh, PVD coating on it. It'll have a, a significantly different look with the with the red labeling, which actually looks pretty good against this. Yeah, the, this. the red, basically, with all of our launch categories, we have the 100 through the 400. They're all different colors, mm -hmm. so if you like higher launch to lower launch. Um, we wanted to make it red, so it fits into that, so it comes in line with the rest of our products. Now, and for those of you that are logo sensitive, you get to see where certainly it has the red logo, but on the back side, you, you're, gonna, you're still going to have the bands, which isn't really... It's not obtrusive at all, and then you have the we'll call it almost a murdered out version of, in the yeah. in the PVD finish uh, in, in this on the other side. So for you guys logo downers, you'll like it and it'll still look good. So there we be right there. Yeah. Now, now there are tons more that's being offered out here, but after going through and listening to all of what was being offered, I thought these two are probably what would be our top or top usage in ours other than maybe the wedge shaft and we'll mm -hmm. cover that at another time. Okay. However, uh, two really nice good products, two that are filling the voids that are out there mm -hmm. and both from the Acra and, and for the custom club maker. So if you're not finding it here in the US and let's say you're in, you're in the UK or on just the other side of the pond looking for this particular product, Lee just happens <laughs> to be that guy that represents the other side of the world for us. Yeah. And uh, so is there another, is it, 
how do they get a hold of you over there? Um, you can go through the Acra Golf website, the True Temper website. Um, all the details are on there that you're going to need to get in touch. Um, telephone numbers, everything. Everything you need, you will find. There you go. And Lee is an expert at this. To the point, he was the very first guy I golfed with when we came to this thing for the very first time. <laughs> Made an international run. They were, they were totally embarrassed to be with me, but it was a fun thing. <laughs> so, again, any you guys have any questions on it, put in the show notes below. And, and as always, you know, ask the questions, keep up with us, and let's see your scores go low.